Welcome back to the Tiger TV Game Day Show. I'm Taylor Curette, alongside assistant coach Charlie Leonard here inside the PMAC awaiting LSU's final home game against Georgia. And Charlie, for two players, Andre Stringer and Siobhan Comey, it'll be their final game as a Tiger. What, what are their emotions like right now before well, the game? They're probably, Taylor, they're probably pretty keyed up. It's uh, for, for Andre, it's been a four-year ordeal from a standpoint of He's been here the whole time, has stayed true to the program. We're excited for him, uh, but the emotions usually get, you know, this is about the time of year that they get a little bit pent up. Uh, you have all your family here. People make arrangements to come in from out of town. So it's, a, it's, a, it's a, an emotional kind of a tightwad thing. And then with, uh, and with Siobhan, Shug is from down here in Thibodeau, so his folks all have all but about a 45-minute ride up here, so there will be a, a nice contingency from down Thibodeau come up here for him too. And Charlie, this is your second year with LSU. You, you came from North Texas right. with uh, Johnny Jones. You, you've coached 14 years with him. How has that time been with Coach Jones, and how have you seen him grow through the tests he's had as a, as a head coach? Well, when I started with Coach Jones, he was the interim coach in Memphis, and then I did 11 years with him down in uh, North Texas and then the two here. So it, it's one of those things where uh, you, you see the whole thing. You see the whole gambit. Uh, uh, First time I, you know, we went to a timeout out in um, Hawaii, uh, and uh, it, it's a whole new experience for a guy that's been in that second seat. And uh, I was very fortunate; I was a head coach all my life before going to, uh, to work with Coach Jones. So uh, I've seen the whole range of growth. So it's been exciting to watch the whole process. Now the Tigers, you guys are seventh in conference right now in the standings. Um, do, do the players talk, or do you talk with the players about? What a win would mean for the seeding as far as the SEC tournament and how important that can be? I don't think you have to tell the kids this time of year. I, I think they're probably more aware of the actual numbers than we are. Uh, I don't pay a whole lot of attention to it. You know, I, I, it's, to me, it's all about preparing for the next game. Uh, and the rest of it takes care of itself. Thank you, Charlie. Uh, back to you guys.